bill called the Cybersecurity Act of 2009. It was put forward earlier this year. It's a bipartisan bill by Senators Jay Rockefeller, a Democrat of West Virginia, and Republican Olympia Snow of Maine. It would allow the president, as you mentioned, to declare a cybersecurity emergency and to do what's necessary to respond to that emergency, including taking control of the Internet if he feels that's the right move. So what would it mean? You know, I've heard the comparison, Catherine, about, you know, President Bush grounding all the planes on 9-11, that if there was some kind of cybersecurity threat that the White House, uh, you know, the folks who are writing this bill believe he should have the ability to do that. Is that right? Well, that really is the best analogy. A short time ago, I spoke with the top cybersecurity official at the, uh, under the, uh, um, sorry, the DNI just had a mental block there a second. <laughs> Under the Bush administration, I get those occasionally. Don't like to admit to it. But anyway, um, he said to me that that really is the best analogy. When the planes were grounded on 9 11, it would be something similar uh, with the Internet. The, bo the bottom line for most people is that the, the type of attack they're worried about in the future would really have two elements to the attack. It would begin with a cyber attack which would cripple communication between government bodies or even first responders and then there would be a follow-on attack, a, a sort of conventional attack that would be almost impossible to respond to because you don't have the communications. And the first type of attack we saw in that vein was the Russian invasion, invasion of Georgia last summer in August. There was a first wave of a cyber attack on the government websites and then that was followed by a conventional attack, the tanks rolling in. So that's the type of scenario that the U.S. government is concerned about. Yeah, yeah it's a concerning scenario. Uh, Catherine Harridge, who very rarely has a mental block. I think that was <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Catherine. Okay, we'll talk to you welcome. soon.